is coming. Every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday morning from 9 to 10 a.m. The Alpha Male is coming, 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 coming. Only on the Steward Media and Entertainment Network. The Alpha Male. Do you have your own radio show? Are you an artist or a DJ? BB Mobile Apps is the solution for you. They specialize in creating mobile apps for entertainers. That's right. You can have your own mobile app where your followers can hear your shows or music, watch your videos, and view all your social networks in one place. You can even make money with banner ads and send push notifications directly to your audience to make sure they get your messages. Everyone has their phones on them, right? A mobile app will add credibility to your brand because your content will be accessible to them while they're on the go. BB Mobile Apps also makes apps for bloggers, actors, and producers. The process only takes about 20 minutes. Just go to bbmobileapps.com and click Get Started Now. That's bbmobileapps.com and tell them the Doug Stewart Show sent you. Doug Stewart here to tell you about my man Smooth at smoothtickets.com. Smooth's got the tickets for everything that you need in the world of sports, concerts, or theater. I don't care what it is. I don't care where it's at in this great land of ours. My man Smooth at SmoothTickets.com, he got them tickets. I'm telling you, boxing, baseball, NBA, NFL, country music concerts, hard rock, hip-hop, theater, Broadway, he's got them all. And if he don't have them, there ain't none. I'm telling you, SmoothTickets.com. Once again, that's SmoothTickets.com or give him a call at 404-374-1150. Once again, that's 404-374-1150. You got to tell him, though, that I sent you. You got to tell him that Doug Stewart sent you. Once again, SmoothTickets.com. That's SmoothTickets.com. Yeah! National Debt Relief is one of the country's largest and most reputable debt settlement companies. Made up of energetic individuals who are passionate about helping thousands of Americans with debt relief. Most importantly, we're all about helping our customers through a tough financial time in their lives with education and individual customer service. We're dedicated to helping individuals and families rid their lives of burdensome debt. Specializing in debt settlement and they've also negotiated settlements for thousands of creditor and collection accounts. Providing clients with both expertise and proven results, this means helping customers in time of hardship to get out of debt with the least possible cost. It can also mean conducting financial consultations, educating the customer, and recommending the appropriate solution. Core Services offer debt settlement as an alternative, I repeat, alternative to bankruptcy, credit counseling, and debt consolidation. National Debt Relief is your number one advocate group to help you reestablish financial stability as quickly as possible. So give us a call at 844-828-4975. Again, that's 844-828-4975 and work it out. It's our number two of the Doug Stewart Show, baby. Let's go. <laughs> July 7th, 2016, Throwback Thursday, coming up in about 15 minutes. We got some little uh, entertainment news and notes, birthdays. A real crazy story, man, uh, concerning Azalea Banks. Y'all remember that name, right? She's all been in the, been in the news a lot over the last couple of months, uh, dissing folks. Um, so we'll get into that coming up in about 15 minutes. Uh, this segment brought to you by my folks from Strickland Security. Strickland Security. Once again, over 55 years combined experience in the business of protecting your home with quality alarm systems, man. Uh, they're my people. The big thing is they're not going to try to upsell you or anything like that. So holla at my folks. All you got to do is go online and check them out at stricklandsecurity.com. That's stricklandsecurity.com. If you're not happy with the customer service with your present alarm system company, holla at my folks at Strickland Security. You know, don't pay folks money when you're not happy with the service. All right? That's StricklandSecurity.com. StricklandSecurity.com. All right, before I went to the break, and you're listening to the Doug Stewart Show, 
Before I went to the break, I was telling you that I have some news about uh, your lodging <laughs> for this year's uh, The Doug Stewart Show Weekend Number 2. Um, and so grab a pencil. I'm going to give you this information right now. This year, TDSS 2, the host hotel will be at none other than... The Double Tree Hotel once again in Buckhead. <laughs> oh boy, I know how to build up drama. Yeah, man, we're going back to the uh, to the Double Tree in Buckhead, man. It was just the best deal that we could possibly find. We already had the relationship with them from last year. Everybody seemed to like the spot in the heart of Buckhead, and I was trying. I was initially talking about trying to get y'all downtown, the other downtown. Uh, the main downtown, but it's just perfect. Everybody that knows Buckhead knows that it's real nice, upscale or whatever. You got all of the shops right there, the convenience. And we got a phenomenal rate for you once again. I think last year it was $99. Bucks. Uh, they added some kind of little $5 tax. So it's $104 a night. Um, once again, at the Buckhead uh, Doubletree Hotel, right in ATL. That's where we're going to be at. And it's cool. I mean, I'm not necessarily saying, uh, obviously, you don't have to stay there if you don't want. I'm not getting a kickback or anything like that for funneling, funneling you guys to the Double Tree. Um, but it's kind of cool. What I observed last year is when we had the party that Saturday night, it's kind of cool walking into the hotel and seeing and meeting some of the Stewies that are sitting at the bar, you know, getting to know each other, having a beer, talking about the show and this, that, and the other. So I walked into the hotel last year. I didn't stay at the Double Tree. I walked in um, that Saturday. And I think I met in the lobby Vince and his wife, like off the rip. And so it was cool, and I think Rel was in there as well. I think I bumped into Rel Scott as well. So, yeah, we're going back to the Double Tree, man. I'll give you a – don't call right now, though. <laughs> Wait until Monday to call and reserve your room. If you do want to stay at the uh, Double Tree Hotel, wait until Monday. They have to get everything in the system, so they told me to tell – uh, the listeners to wait until Monday to make the call and book the room. And we only have a certain block of rooms, and once they're gone, they're gone. So first thing Monday morning, if you want to stay at the host hotel for the Doug Stewart Show weekend number two, it's the Doubletree Hotel in Buckhead, the same hotel that we were at last year. And uh, over the next couple of weeks, I'll give you more details about where we're going to meet and greet and kick it. we definitely going to put in a an adult nightclub uh, <laughs> soiree into the move. Last year, only a couple of people went out there. Uh, but we're going to try to organize that again. Maybe we'll go to Magic City or something like that, man, and, and do what we do. <laughs> Ladies invited to. Ladies invited to. Um, let's see. Let's read some of the messages in the chat room on Spreaker.com. From Rail Scott, how many rooms do you have blocked off? I think they gave us 20. And then we have the option to get more after, uh, you know, if the 20 go fast. Oh, and another thing, you have until August 19th to get your room at the Doubletree and then the, the, the deal goes bye-bye. I think normally their rate is like 150 Dollars or something like that. So you're getting a pretty good deal uh, for where you're going to be located at. Um, so run, kiss my ass, Pat Riley, CNC, ha ha, ninja. That DJ not playing the hits. Uh, from that ninja, Doug, please, please, please don't get the same DJ. Oh, come on, man. Y'all ain't like the DJ? It's my man, Turk. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to do something different. We might do something totally different. I don't know if we'll even do the, the ballroom setup. We may get like a section at a lounge or a nightclub or something like that because um, that's something else I heard a lot from last year was people wanted to see more of ATL. Once again, y'all look for any opportunity to come to Atlanta. So we're still kind of planning what we're going to do. We're definitely going to do some type of meet and greet Friday night at some place, and then Saturday night we'll probably do more of a – a uh, lounge, upscale lounge, nightclub, or something like that. We also plan to play golf Saturday morning with the students that want to play golf with me and Ryan. Uh, we'll play golf Saturday morning. Uh, we'll do the nightclub slash lounge Saturday night. And Sunday, once again, this year we planned it on the weekend with the Falcons. We're going to have a home game. You can come and experience the two live students tailgate at the Georgia Dome if you want to stay Sunday. 
Đấy. From that ninja, he says, get the DJ from New Year's Eve. He's a beast. Oh, yeah, you talking about uh, uh, DJ Cass. Yeah, I've had Cass DJ my parties for many, many, many years. Uh, he does a real, real big Willie style. Shouts out to DJ Cass. From the Kicking It With Kesey show, Kesey says they hating Turk was cool. Well, let me, let me tell you why. Let me tell you about my man Turk. My man Turk Nice. Used to DJ parties when I was at South Carolina State University. <laughs> so that's my man's in them. And I know Turk can make the people move. I don't know what y'all didn't like about him. Uh, from Chuchi busting at the seams, do you get a discount if you order pay-per-view early? If not, you're not thinking clearly if you order early. Uh, what are you talking about? I don't know exactly what they're talking about. Um, from that ninja Doug, tell the truth. I'm the only one that came and Ryan showed up later. Shoe show dessert. <laughs> well, we kind of had, I, I'm going to tell you the truth. I'm going to tell you the truth. Was that Saturday night or was that Friday night? I think it might've been Friday night. I'm going to tell you the truth. It was kind of bad design and it might still be bad design to try to do the strip club thing because... Whenever we did the strip club night, it was it was Friday night. It was a Saturday night. I can't remember. But whatever night it was, we, we kind of partied earlier. And so we were drinking. And, you know, at our age, most of y'all are my demo of, of uh, you know, age group. You're my peers. And so we had already been drinking earlier. And a lot of us were kind of slizzard. And, you know, so by the time we were done, it was already midnight, 1 o'clock. And we old. So we went home and got into bed. <laughs> Yeah, that's what happened. It was bad design. You know, back in the day when we were younger, <laughs> I'm just keeping it real. Back in the day when we were younger, we would go to the strip club at 1, 2 o'clock in the morning. You know? Um, and I'm seeing that it was Friday night. So Friday night, we were at the little old spot uh, downtown. I can't even remember the name of it right now. And we had been drinking kind of heavy. So I think, you know, when, when you when you 40-something years old and you had more than two drinks, it's hard to just go into a nightclub or to a strip club at 12, 1 o'clock in the morning. But we was just tired and old. I didn't even go, and I set the damn thing up. <laughs> I set it up, and I didn't even go. So, yeah, I apologize about that, T. We're going to look at that. We're going to try to figure out how we can do that. We'll figure out how we can try to do that. All right, when we get back from the break, man, um, man, we got some sports stories I need to get to. SEC Media Days. Uh, got to talk about John Bones Jones for a minute. Uh, but we got entertainment and birthdays up next. This is the funnest show, the realest show in America, the Doug Stewart Show. Back in three minutes. Don't go away. Hey, Vince Wright here. Sports Done Right is my show. Make sure you're listening on Wednesdays on SME. The Sports Gov, Sports Done Right, SME. Three things that go great together. Doug Stewart here to tell you about my man Smooth at SmoothTickets.com. Smooth's got the tickets for everything that you need in the world of sports, concerts, or theater. I don't care what it is. I don't care where it's at in this great land of ours. Well, man, Smooth at SmoothTickets.com, he got them tickets. I'm telling you, boxing, baseball, NBA, NFL, country music concerts, hard rock, hip-hop, theater, Broadway, he's got them all. And if he don't have them, there ain't none. I'm telling you, SmoothTickets.com. Once again, that's Smooth tickets.com or give them a call at 404-374-1150 once again that's 404-374-1150 you gotta tell them though that i sent you you gotta tell them that doug stewart sent you once again smooth tickets.com that's smooth tickets.com yeah fantasy sports fans are winning huge cash prizes every day at draftkings.com America's favorite place to play daily fantasy sports. 